Before we move on, we should deal with one common question, which is, what is the magnification of a camera or a telescope or something like that? Now, magnification is actually not a very useful number to deal with. By magnification, we mean how much bigger you make something look. But if you take a, a small blurry image and you photocopy it up, you can turn it into a large blurry image. But it's still blurry and you don't see any more detail. If there was a number plate you couldn't read before, there will still be a number plate you can't read afterwards. So making an image bigger by itself doesn't help you. What really matters is angular resolution. Let's say you have two dots. Are they going to look like one big fuzzy blur, or can you actually see that they are two dots? And this is measured by angular resolution, which is how much the light from a point is blurred out, and it's an angle theta. And we've seen that for a typical smartphone camera, this is about 2 by 10 to the minus 4 radians. Which is about one arc minute. But how does this compare to the human eye? Well, I thought I'd experiment on this. What I did was I drew two dots on a piece of paper one millimetre apart. And I propped that piece of paper up on the side of my office and I walked back a step at a time until I could no longer see that they were two dots and it just looked like one dot or a blur to me. And it turns out I could walk back about five metres before I could no longer separate them out as being two dots. They just looked like one. I could no longer pick them apart. Similarly, if I take writing, that's about a millimetre in size, so a fairly small font, I can read it out to a distance of about five metres. So what that means is that the angular resolution of the human eye is about one millimetre over five metres. So it's using a small angle approximation, that's 10 to the minus 3 over 5, which comes out as about 2 by 10 to the minus 4 radians, or about one arc minute. So what that's telling us is that the resolution of a human eye, and my eyesight's fairly good at distance, is about the same as the resolution of a smartphone camera. So they can see about the same level of detail. So in that sense, you can say the camera has a magnification of about one. You can see about the same detail as the human eye, with a fairly good vision human eye, not someone who's short-sighted, at about the same sort of distances. A telephoto lens or telescope might do much better and pick up much finer detail. So that's really the way to think about magnification. It's not about making images bigger, it's about how much detail you can see.